What's up, YouTube? I'm your boy, Double A Nine Skills. Welcome back to the Road for Champions RTG Edition. More like our Top 100 Reward Edition, baby. A lot of people on Twitter were like, Skills, don't you do it. Don't you open up that Top 100 pack. I'm doing it. Today is the day that we open up the Top 100 pack. I'm going to explain why. We held our pack from last week to this week. Remember, we didn't open it because it was only that Sanchez to get, so we held it. But this week, it's a little bit different. I'll tell you why I'm going to open up the pack. Before we do that, yo, bros, can you smash a big old thumbs up for this? This sexy, sexy, sexy top 100 pack we're gonna open up i'm gonna give you two reasons why i want to open up this pack number one bros number one i don't like holding packs all year last year whether we got top 100 or we did it and we did get top 100 a lot last year bros i opened it no matter what whether team of the week was good or bad or good or bad or good or bad i opened it i just didn't oh I, I opened it no matter what i opened it because first of all y'all love these packs so y'all deserve to see these packs second of all bros I hate holding it. Like, this weekend, once I lost two games in my head, I was like, it's okay, I got the top 100 pack. It's okay, I got the top 100 pack. So I wasn't really, you know what I mean? I, I felt like it was messing up my focus on the weekend league. I want to open this pack and get it out the way. Not only that, there's a good, 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 very good reason for why I want to open it up. This Mertens card, let me show y'all something. Um, before we open this bag, let me show y'all something. Yo, if you guys haven't subscribed already, make sure to subscribe. In the week in, in squad battles, we are fifth in the world right now, bros. Once this resets, I'm going to play the game, but I'm going to live com the game and post it on my second channel. So right now, it should be live. Link in the description down below. It, hopefully, I, I posted that video already. Um, you could check out. I'm going to show you exactly how I do how I'm getting number one. My tactics, my tips, a complete live com game of me playing squad battles. Link down below. Check it out, all right? That's to my second channel. Make sure to subscribe if you like career mode and vlogs um now with that being said let me show y'all something real quick boyer nation before we jump into this y'all know our new team if you missed the last episode go check it out our new team is sexy but look at this for one second just just work with me for one second just look at this for one second bros so the team would all stay the same right if this happened, we could sell Gareth Bale, who we packed. I don't want to. I'm just saying we could sell him. We could also sell Griezmann, depending on what we pack here. But I want to I want to show y'all something, right? I was sitting here thinking when I was looking. A lot of people were telling me, Skills, don't open that damn pack, man. Don't open it. But I want to show y'all something, right? If we got this 88 Mertens, let's just say we got him, right? And then we come over to this side. You're like, Skills, how are you going to make that work, though? Oh, we're going to make that work. I want to show y'all how we're going to make that work. My boy, JJ Akocha, the 85 one. Uh, uh. The 85 version. Look at the stats on this thing, bros. Four-star weak foot, five-star skiller, 88 pace, 80 shooting, 79 passing. So we go to the 4-1-2-1-2. Anthony Martial, right striker. Mertens, left striker. He has a right foot. It's a four-star weak foot. It's a four-star skill moves. The team would look incredibly nasty. He wouldn't be full chem. Oh, snap. I didn't think about that. He, he wouldn't be full chem. Oh, I, I, I didn't think about that. How would we make him full chem? I didn't think about that part. We could figure it out. We could figure this out. We could figure out a way to get this man on full chem. Could we figure out a way? I don't know. Hopefully, we could figure out a way to get this guy on full chem. Because could you imagine Mertens? I mean, right now, he would be on eight. At striker, he would be on eight. I would actually play him on eight. Legit, I would play him on eight. Him on eight. A coach would be on full chem. Obviously, he's a legend. Once we move him, he'll be on the right chem. We just got to get the right manager and then bang, uh, my boy Mertens would be on full chem. I mean on 8 chem. I'd rock him. We're already using Gareth Bale on 8 chem. Why not use Mertens on 8 chem? So that could be pretty nasty. Also, Iguahin sells for over uh, 200k, I think. Uh, Cavani sells for over 200k. So there's a lot of money to be made. Last week there was only Sanchez. This week there's a lot of money to be made. Iguahin sells. Mertens sells. Um... The boy Cavani sells. I wonder if Fernandinho sells. I, I would imagine Fernandinho sells for at least a little bit, right? Let's check real quick and let's open this bad boy up. We ain't got time for this. We want to see what's popping in this pack. And we could wait around, bros. We could wait and wait and wait and wait and wait. Did I spell that right? Did I spell his name? I probably spell his. Oh, goodness. Don't do this to me, skills. Don't spell his name wrong, man. Guys, I could wait and wait and wait for Ronaldo or Messi or Neymar to have a good weekend and then open the pack. But then you have to wait and hope and pray and pray and hope and wait to, that, you, that you actually pack him as well. We opened a lot of top on packs last week bro i mean last year and we never received ever 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 received um a big card like that except for obamian we hit obamian one time i think didn't we um but besides that we never really hit a uh, big card so uh fernandingo is selling for a whopping 100k as well you see what i'm saying so we can make 100k on fernandingo we can make 100k on Mer uh, more than 100k on mertens more than 100k on cavani and on iguahin there's a lot of cards so this is a good team of the week to open up there's money to be made all we gotta hit is a cavani a mertens a fernandingo 
or uh, Iguain. I clearly want Mertens. Mertens is my guy. Ter Stegen might be selling as well. So let's do it, man. We're popping this bad boy open. Smash a big old thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe. You guys know what the deal is. Top 100. Our first top 100. 11 team of the week players in this pack. Please be big. Please be monstrous. Let's pop it open, man. I did it. It's here. It's happening. It's going down right now. I'm recording. It's copacetic. Come on, baby. Let's go. Come on. Give me something good, please. Please, EA. Please let somebody walk out on this one. Please. It's it's Fernandinho. No! I wanted Mertens. Damn. Bros, Mertens would have been monstrous. Ah. Mertens would have been great. That really sucks. Mertens, Cavani, Iguain, any of those guys would have been great. We got Fernandinho. Ah, man, that sucks. Okay, wait, but we still make money, which is nice. We're still going to make money. I don't regret my decision. Hey, this card looks all right. I don't regret my decision at all. I really don't regret it. Hopefully, we make a little bit of money here. What's he going for, man? He looked like he was going for 100K. Is he still? Is he? 150 that's going for 170 we'll start him at 150 we could use him as well his car looks pretty we should use him actually that car looks pretty nasty should we use him who would we drop though we would we would drop do we drop conte would you drop conte for fernandino would y'all do it medium high 80 physical 81 pit Ooh. would you drop for not would you drop conte would you sell conte Ooh, that's a tough one, bros. Oh, no, I wanted to sell that. I wanted to sell that. He's going for 20. We're going to make money. Obviously, sucks. I really wanted that Mertens, man. I, it would have been lit with that Mertens. But no Mertens. I'm not mad. I think I still made the right decision because there was a big chance we got him. Um, tomorrow, we get the Elite Rewards. Maybe we'll get a Mertens out the Elite Rewards. Oh, Lozano. Oh, baby. Wait a minute. Super sub Lozano. Four-star skill, a four-star weak foot. Look at that speed. Super sub. Listen, Lozano's not going nowhere, bros. Lozano's a super sub, 100%. He's not going nowhere. Lozano's our super sub, 100%. We're using him. Um, this guy's probably not selling for nothing. I'll just lob him up. Like I said, bros, it's not the it's not the craziest team of the week, but I felt that if we got Iguahim Mertens and stuff like that, we would have made money. We still made a lot of money, bros. Damn, he sells for a hundred. Yo, we made good money. Hey, we made a lot of money, actually. I'm not mad at that. We made a ton of money. I am not mad at this pack. Yo, he sells for a hundred K. We could actually keep him. Oh man, what do I do? Do I keep Fernandinho or do I keep Conte? All right. So Fernandinho has better passing and shooting. The same defense. Damn it, that Fernandinho card looks nasty, bros. Right, bros, there's only one thing we possibly could do. I gotta try him. We gotta go into a game, we gotta try him. I haven't live comm many games this year, but I'm live comming a game with y'all because y'all are gonna see my first impression on this Fernandinho. I gotta buy him a shadow card because if we're gonna test him, we gotta test him to his full capacity. We gotta see if he's good. We gotta throw a shadow on him. We gotta make sure that he's better than Conte and better than Bakioko because I've actually been debating whether I keep Conte and just rock Bakioko uh, for the hype but now that we got Fernandinho now I'm debating this do I rock Fernandinho over Conte and Bakioko and just sell Conte and get my money back I don't know what the right answer is right now but this Fernandinho card looks pretty incredible I'm not gonna lie to you so we're gonna throw a shadow on him we're gonna put him in that midfield we're gonna jump into a division one game and we're gonna see if we can win and how he plays so as of right now in division one we're five wins zero ties zero losses we're jumping into this d1 game with a team that looks just like this fernandingo obviously will drop to cdm with conte and v i mean excuse me with pugba and vidal out on the sides in the 4-2-3-1 excuse me 4-1-2-1-2 uh we'll have griezmann at cam with gareth bale and anthony martial at our striker positions and our defense looks like that so that's what's popping conte's now on the bench for now lozano is going to be a super sub but i need to put a hunter or something on him um who would actually, who would we leave behind? Damn, uh, you know what? I'm actually willing to think about leaving back Alessandrini. Uh, let's see, we'll leave Alessandrini back for this one. This Lozano card looks like he could be something magical. Obviously, he needs a chemistry style. We're jumping into a D1 game. Let's find out how good this Fernandinho is. Let's find out if this Fernandinho should play for us this weekend league or if we should sell him and keep Conte. Bros, our first Division 1 game with Fernandinho, and we're going to jump into this one against the EPL side, but he has that Mertens, regular Mertens card. The boy Night Golan, that Night Golan card, man. If you guys don't know, I do a little bit of live streaming on Twitch TV, not often. 
often, but uh, twice a week for like two or three hours. Um, just so you know, I can chill with you guys and talk for a while, do some stuff live. And on PlayStation, I've been playing over there. And I got Nigolan on that account, and Nigolan is magical. Um, I know a lot of people in the comments down below will question if I should have opened this pack or not, or if I should have saved it. Um, I don't like saving packs, man. I was even pissed when I saved it last week. I just like to open it, whether it's big or, like, because we work so hard for it, man. Uh, regardless, it's going to make us some type of money, which will put the series in a better place. So I'm happy with that decision. I know a lot of you guys in the comments will not be happy with that decision, but I'm extremely happy. We, we had a chance. In life, you got to take chances sometimes, man. Oh, wait, I had it right. Uh, you got to take chances sometimes, and I wanted to take a chance. I wanted that Mertens. Um, unfortunately, we didn't hit him. Uh, so the Mertens, uh, JJ Okocha dream is, is still just a dream. Does he feel fast? Does he feel slow? Does Bakioko feel better? Does Conte feel better? So many questions. Obviously, one game won't answer. Oh, no, I messed up. Oh, bad defense. Um, one game probably won't answer the questions, but... Uh, one game will be a little bit to oh, he's apologizing. He, pro he probably knows us. It's all right, big boy. Good goal, man. Um, what was I gonna say? Uh, one game will hopefully give me like a good like indication, like seeing him on the pitch already. He looks so small that I'm thinking, you know, if I'm if I'm using him for the height, he doesn't look much bigger than Conte. I don't even know if he looks bigger at all than Conte. Um, but maybe he does. Maybe I'm just crazy. Nice pass in here. Let's see what we can do, baby. Oh, Vidal. Yo, loses out to Nigola. We're getting smacked right now. I'm going to have to switch formations. Nice. Oh, I thought I had it. Oh, he got me again. Oh, oh we're getting smacked. Oh, the hair saves my life. That's a good pass. We might have. Griezmann was, Griezmann was feeling it. I saw you, Griez. I'm sorry, man. Raph. Hey, get Eric Baez. On. Eric Baez on another level. This, this man's on another level. He's on steroids. Good passing. I could have Gareth Bell. I do. He brought that keeper. Let's go. He brought the keeper, but then stopped with the keeper. And Gareth Bale on his weak foot. Does weak foot count when it comes to chipping? Because he chipped that with his weak foot, but it looked like it was his strong foot. He's a three-star. But I always feel like when I chip the ball, that it just it just like avoids the fact that it's a three-star. Does that make sense? Any player I use, if they have a three-star weak foot, every time I chip, it just seems like it doesn't matter with the chips. Like it just chips just counter all like weak foot, whatever it is. I don't know. Maybe I'm crazy when I say that, but. Okay, all right, now nah, I'm seeing something. Yeah, yeah, it's building up nice. Oh, 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 it's building up nice. He half brought the keeper again. Then he stepped back inside, and Anthony Martial! They playing no games. Good goal, Anthony Martial. Hey, let's go, boys. All right, so we're slowly building ourselves back into this game. Slowly but surely, but one thing I gotta say is he's going through my midfield like it's nobody's business. So, one thing I can say, obviously, one game can't really judge. I haven't noticed Fernandinho at all i haven't seen him make any great interceptions nothing really tracking wise um so that's pretty interesting but he has walked my midfield but like it's nobody's business but again ibrahimovic um he has the boy night goal and he has a very strong team there's there's my man fernandinho getting a little touch right there nice job dembele dancing on him okay i see you let me slow down oh i see i was playing the night goal pass and that worked out well good pass from fernandinho one thing that really like turned me on about fernandinho um, you know what I mean? Like the fact that I thought, you know what, we could rock with him is the passing. He has some pretty decent passing for a CDM, which is pretty good. My man Pogba, ooh, that's a terrible foul. My man Conte, I mean, Bale, what do you do? I slow up. Gareth Bale, looking for, ah, Eric Bae once again. Oh, give me that. Okay, I missed it. Okay, I missed it. Stop it. Stop it. Yes, Boateng. Mm. I'm going to, I think I might sub in Bakioko and see if we feel the midfield changes. No! Stop that, Gareth Bale! Gareth Bale, stop that, bro! Oh, he's throwing up the hearts, bro. Gareth Bale throwing up the hearts. Now, that was a sexy play, too. Good build-up. That's what Griezmann's there for, literally. Just play the ball back to Gareth Bale and let Gareth Bale do Gareth Bale-type things, right, Bullion Nation? That's exactly what he's there for, um, for that simple reason. This game started very, very poor for us, but luckily we were able to turn it around somehow. Let me get back. No, no, no. Fernandinho, please. Yes! Uh-oh. Oh, oh, Fernandinho. Oh, man. Did y'all see that? I made the interception with him. I stepped in to cut the ball, but he didn't cut the ball properly or something. I don't know. The ball just went back to, oh, it's 3-2 now. I want to see if, like, we stop suffering, if we start to control the midfield a little bit better. We've given up a lot of goals for our first half, man. That's not something you want to be doing in foot champs, is it? Anthony Martial. Easy peasy. Easy peasy, Anthony Martial. The boy's a goat, man. Anthony Martial is something else, bro. He's so good. I'll show you his stats 
after this game. It's it's unreal the stats he's done for me. Griezmann, another assist. That's what you want from your cam. That's why he's that's why we brought him back. We brought him back for this. For this reason right here. That's why you're back in the lineup, boy. All right. Halftime. Um Fernandinho. Yeah, he's getting it, boys. He's 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 getting it. I think he I think we're pulling I think we're pulling him. Tackles one. Fernandinho zero of three. All right, zero of three for Fernandinho, bros. We're bringing in Bakayoko for the rest of this game, and we're gonna see if the midfield stays the same or if we start to dominate because we have been we have been poor. Let's be honest. We've scored goals, but midfield stopping long shots, stopping. We've been absolutely poor, disgustingly poor. I don't know if I like the team like that, man. I, man. I want to say that, Fern that Fernandino card looks so good, though. We're there. Well, we were there. David Oliver. Oh, stop it, EA. <laughs> good goal, my man. Well played. Damn, good goal, bro. Good goal. 4-3. Oh, man, we're giving up goals like it's nobody's business. Stop it. We can't really blame our midfield for that one, can we? Or can or maybe we should. I don't know. I don't know. Anthony Martial's right there. It's a golasso. It's a golasso. Anthony Martial. Just kidding. He drag backs. Don't let him shoot. Bakioko! Yes, Bakioko! Let's go! That's what he's there for. That's what he's there for, Bakioko. Pop it. Anthony, back into bail. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. No way, no way, no, 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 no. Oh, this Eric Bailly, bro. Eric Bailly is stopping Gareth Bale. I'm asleep. Bakioko right there. Let's go. Oh, that's the pass they nerfed, bros. <laughs> Never do those passes. They nerfed that. That's just terrible. Oh, man. Anthony Martial steps inside. Anthony Martial still with Anthony. Yes, there Yo, they is saving us. Uh, no, no, no subs, no subs. Yo, actually, sub, sub, sub. I want to bring in um, what's his face, man? I want to bring in Lozano. I should change formations too, cause my formation's trash right now. My boy Lozano for Griezmann and uh, Gabriel Jesus for. Do we pull out Gareth Bale here? Anthony Martial's too good to pull. Ah. Uh, yeah, I'm pulling Bale. Yo, that's how much I love Anthony Martial. Y'all just saw me pull a Gareth Bale over pulling Anthony Martial. I'm telling you, I love Anthony Martial in this game. He's so good um, that I'm that I'm pulling out. I'm pulling out the boy. If he scores off of a corner again, I'm calling cheese. Oh, he almost did as well. Stop that. Gabriel Suits into the game alongside Lozano. Good pass and Dembele lets it rip. Woo -hoo -hoo. De Gea's hands on fire. Anthony Martial chilling. Woo! I see you. Yo, Gabriel Asus, making Gabriel Asus type runs. Give me the corner. Ah, I wanted to get the corner. <laughs> Vidal, my boy Vidal. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. What do we do? What do we do? Ah, ah. Lozano. Ah! Lozano, stop it. Yo, let's go. 5-3. <laughs> All right, man. So we're going to pick up the W. Um... I'm going to be honest, man. Were we better first half or second half? I don't know. I know that Fernandinho didn't really do much. And again, I'm not going to judge him based off of one game. I would need a lot of games with him. Based off of that one game, my entire team played back. Yo, Lozano's missing goals. Thank goodness Vidal was there. Um, Lozano missed two goals this game. Bros, I don't know what to do. I really don't. We're going to make a lot of money on this 100K pack. That's for sure. I just don't know if we should uh, sell Fernandinho or Conte because they both go for about the same money. Uh, we're going to make a ton of money. Like that young sells for a lot. Uh, he sells for like 50. Uh, the Liverpool, uh, the Arsenal left back sells for a lot. So we're going to make a little bit of money here. The biggest question is about Gareth Bale. I mean, about uh, Fernandinho and, and, and Conte. I really don't know what to do. I think I'm going to sell Fernandinho. I think the thing to do here is to sell Fernandinho and keep Conte around. Um... I just, I feel like it's the right move, bros. Conte was so good for us last year. He was our guy last year. We loved him. He did so much for us that I think the only thing to do is to sell Fernandinho. So Fernandinho right now, we start him at 170. Um, and it looks like he'll go for that. So I think it's the right move, bros. I don't know if it's the right move, but I feel inside it's the right move. So I'm listening, big boy, for Nandingo. I hope you guys enjoyed our rewards, bros. Hopefully you guys did. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Um, uh, yo, this Lozano card, is he better than, better than Alessandrini? What foot is he? Is he a lefty or a righty? He's a righty. That's weird. He missed that low driven. Hope you guys enjoyed our rewards. Um, I think I made the right decision by popping it open. We're obviously going to make like at least 500K. Um, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I love you guys. Thank you. Big old thumbs up. If you enjoyed, make sure to subscribe. And hopefully I can get you some more top 100 packs, man. Hopefully next week we'll have a better team of the week. Uh, we have more rewards coming tomorrow. More Elite 1 rewards, which is pretty chill. Or Elite 2 rewards, which is pretty chill. Thank you guys so much for watching. Big thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe. I'm going to catch you guys soon. Booyah. We out.
Yo, what's going on, YouTube? I'm your boy, Double A, not skills. This right here is the Rotor for Champions RTG edition. Welcome back, bros. I hope you're having a fantastic day. This edition is the buying a new beast team edition. And I know when you're looking at this team, you're like, skills, is that really a new team? You're going back to Eric Bailly. You're going back to David Ahea. You're going back to, not back, first time ever, Paul Pogba. And also going back to Antoine Griezmann. What's happening here, man? Why are you going back? Well, bros, if I could tell the future, I promise you I would never sold De Gea or Eric Bailly or Antoine Griezmann. We picked up Ferdinand for the weekend league and instead of getting top 100 like we did last week we ended up doing bad and only getting elite two that's not bad we just didn't do as good as week one for now we're gonna end up losing 10,000 coins on plus tax a bit more we're gonna sell Mbappe who we lost a little bit of money on him but let's be honest Mbappe got his elite finishes top 100 so we actually made money on him we sold Insigne who I bought as a super sub we sold Casemiro who we got out that Gareth Bale pack and uh Neuer who we lost a little bit on unfortunately but player prices are dropping but 